Pride, and welcome back to another episode of Battletech. Alright, so I do have a side quest here. I know I said I wasn't going to do a lot of these um, for you guys, that most of them were going to be uh, on the, on the, it's uh, kind of on the side, and uh, if I did, if I recorded them, then I was going to be recording them for my Patreon. Uh, but I thought, you know what, this is a nice big shot here. I mean, this is garrison duty. We're defending a base. It's the Badlands, which, uh, of course, means we're going to have to deal with a little bit of heat uh, and some uh, winds and such, crystalline deposits and things. Uh, it's a three and a half, uh, but this is what kind of excited me right here was the five out of 22 and the 1.17 million. Uh, so we're going to do this. We are going to give this a try. Uh, I want to... We're not hard up for money at the moment. This kind of is floating my boat here. I, because three, three and a half means chances are it's going to have heavies, possibly even an assault. Hmm. And I'm not desperate for money. You know what? We're just going to do this. Roger that, Commander. Course plotted. And we are going to set a course for Ungard. It's on the way anyway. We need some times to let our mechs get fixed. Um, now, it's been quite a while since I have recorded. Um, I've, I've kind of had a lot going on in my life lately, and so I haven't had a chance to record. Um, as you guys know, I tend to record in large groups just because I get a lot of things happening in my life. So, I don't remember if I've told you guys or not about the grasshopper that I have. Uh, I, uh, in, in one of my, um, in one of my battles that I had, um, I want to say it was off screen. Gosh, I'm sorry guys, it's, it's been a long time, I don't remember. <laughs> Uh, but it's been, it's, I, I do have a grasshopper now, and I have built this to the specifications that I want it to be at. I will show this to you, uh, when it is completed. I'm very excited about this. I finally have my grasshopper, um, and Lion should be, like, back in business once he's done, so we should have our perfect pairing of, of Lion and grasshopper, uh, and we'll be able to see if my theory truly does hold water. All right. Before we go anywhere, let's take a look at our... Nothing exciting. And piece of Wolverine. Ooh. 25% crit and plus one stabilization. That's interesting. That'll be good on my... Uh, on my LRM boat. Huh. You know what? I think I'm gonna go ahead and get that. New weapon systems available. And let's see, what, what mechs am I gonna take out for this particular... It's defending the base, which means we're gonna have uh, a, a little bit of close in and a little bit of long range. So most likely I'm going to take out the Highlander. Uh, the king crab. Well, the Highlander, the king crab, and probably the two Orions. So if I were to switch out, yeah, see the I, what I want to do is I want to switch out that for the new one. So if I were to switch out one of the Orions, then I guess I could replace it with. The catapult and take a ch and take a chance and see what uh, see what it's like to use the the uh, PPCs with this uh, slight slightly changed configuration I have here. It's for the most part this is pretty much the stock catapult, uh, at least the PPC uh, variant of the uh, of the catapult. I could also do the. I could bring in my my close range thunderbolt. You know what? That may not be a bad idea either. Well, okay. Let's let's just go ahead and refit the Orion with the new with 
the new weapon. There we go. I like that. Additional damage on one, additional crit and stabilization damage on the other. For now, that will do until we get better, better quality stuff. I like this. That'll probably take a couple, three days. Okay. All right, so that LRM boat Long is currently end. off the books. Shouldn't be too hard. Let's, oop, uh, let's go back to here. Let's launch the contract. All right, so. Yeah, one of our... Okay, so, yeah, uh, Lion is out for the time being. Uh, do we want to bring in our second stream team? Give our second stream team some experience? You know what? That's not a bad idea. Let's, let's, let's bring on, bring in our second stream. All right, so if we're bringing in second stream, then spare parts goes on to our LRM boat. She's our, uh, she's our distance gal. Uh, Scoundrel and Relentless and Rebound. Rebound. Let's see, all three of these guys are stand and deliver types. Um, let's see. I think I want to do Rebound on King Crab. I think I want to do Relentless on Highlander. And then Scoundrel, you can be here. And who do we want to pair you up with? Let's try the Catapult. I've never tried this before. Catapults tend to run run a little bit hot for my tastes. Uh, at least for tabletop it does. I've never actually done tried one in-game. Um, I mean, that one battle we had with Lady... Uh, Victoria Espinosa. Uh, she was burning herself up, like, pretty hard. Um, and I've actually seen some gameplay where she was, like, more than willing to just, like, roast her mech uh, until it shut down. Uh, and it was so easy for her to do it. So that's why I'm kind of going, uh, how do I feel about this, really? Um, but for a sniper mech, it's not a bad deal at all. So... Uh, it's still allergy season for me, guys, so again, uh, terribly, terribly sorry for the sniffing and the snorting and the snotting and the blucky. I'm going to hopefully Command not have much of this. <coughs> Excuse me. This isn't much of a facility, Commander. I'm not sure what our employers were expecting. Scratch that, Commander. Orbital imagery is showing multiple incoming hostile contacts. There are a lot of them. Buckle up, Commander. This is going to get exciting. A lot of them. Okay. Well, that's always fun to listen to, uh, to listen to in here. Hold out for reinforcements for ten rounds. Defend the buildings. Ensure all buildings survive. Destroy the vanguard. All right. So they're coming from over here. So how do we want to do this? And I am, like, way out of position over here. Uh, all right, then. Tell you what, we're currently in sprint mode, so let's just sprint. Uh, should I jump instead? No, sprinting is about the same speed. So let's just Confirmed. get you over here. Let, let's just start making our way there. over. Okay. And the Orion, you know what? The Orion can be right here. Ah, the move. Are you serious? Already it's under fire? What kind of bogusness is this? 
Okay, so that's... Hey. Sucks. All right, let's get you forward as far as we can. Hopefully we can see some people. There we go. No, okay. All right, so at least we have something on the radar here. Uh, Commander. Scoundrel, let's see if we can't move you forward and do a Copy lock that. for spare parts to, to start launching on. I've got a sensor lock. That's a cicada. Go. Okay, well at least it's something. Uh, oh, okay. Or maybe I have no chance at all. Oh, come on! How was I supposed to deal with this? This is... Oh, and is this... Let me guess. It's going to take it out before I even have a chance to do anything. All right, that's lightweight. Man, I was about to start calling yes, on, shenanigans yes. there. All right, let's get you in closer. All right, I have no shot anywhere, but I can at least light him up. Because we need to, we need to start. Got a lock. We need to start, like, making him stop. That's a griffin. All right, so that's pro that's what's been causing damage here. So we need to start making by. something happen here. Uh, let's see, what kind of shot have I got right now? 50s and 70s. Uh, what is hampering this? Long range. Uh, okay, so what if we were to get you closer? Not much better, actually. What about here? Still not much better. Uh, but I'll go ahead and move you forward. All right, and let's put some fire on this thing. Good grief. Copy that. All right. I'm here. Highlander, uh, let's get you up and running over here. Excuse me. And I'm thinking maybe I want to split this up a bit. And we'll go one, or no, uh, ulti target. One and two. And that's beautiful. I like that just as it is. Um, it's kind of a pity about the 55s there, but really, that's okay. It's just because of all this. Let's do this. I'll try. And... <laughs> Put his butt on the ground. That wasn't bad at all. All right, rebound. Oh, man. Rebound, you are so slow. Let's get you over to here so at least you've got a shot at something. All right. You've at least got a shot at something. Not much of one, though. Jeez. All right, let's precision strike this just so you've got a better shot at hitting things. Uh, and we're just going to take this bad boy out. Acknowledge. Quit missing! Seriously? You are hurting Critical my feelings hit, Commander. right now. Hurting my feelings. I'm picking up a new sensor trace. Looks like enemy reinforcements. Yeah, of course it is. Oh, okay. So, but at least it's coming from this direction. Sensor show more bonded. Stop shooting at my buildings. Oh, guys are 
Okay, if this fails me before I get a chance to do anything at all, I'm going to be extremely upset. Because this is, this is, so far, this is turning out to be an extremely bogus situation. I'm having no chance to be able to react to this stuff. They're just crushing my, crushing my stuff. Receiving you. Uh, oh, sorry about that, guys. I had a, I had a computer alarm set. <laughs> Uh, scoundrel, let's get you... Uh, yeah, let's get you over here. Facing this direction here. Roll to that. Let's see if we can't just remove this griffin as a po uh, as a... As a possibility here. Uh, yeah, we're just gonna take it out. Firing! Come on, kill it! Thank you! Most one! Alright, they're moving. Okay, you can cut it out now. <laughs> What's up, boss? Uh, is that really all the shot I have with her? That really is the only shot I have for her, so I'm going to reserve her for the time being. Oh, I... Come on! A friendly structure has been destroyed. Well, ain't gonna get the bonus. That just... Oh, no. That just seems extremely unfair. Uh, Commander? I mean, you've got... And, and it's coming from this direction. Who the heck is shooting from this direction? At least I think it's coming from this direction. Wish you could back out a little bit so uh, so you could see the whole the whole battlefield. I cannot see anything. All right, let's jump ourselves. Wow, you are so slow. I need to do something about. I don't know how to be able to speed up a king crab, though, other than... Roger. I mean, piloting skill only goes so far. Alright, let's remove the PPCs. And, yeah, let's just, let's just hope... Wow, what? Why am I having such awful chances to hit? All right, precision strike. We're gonna try to we're gonna try to just remove this as a target and hope it's enough. Wow. Confirm. Thank you. That's a kill. I may have brought in the wrong team for this. All right, relentless. I'm here. Get you in on this battle here. Okay, let's go. A Vindicator and a Wolverine. I think once again we're going to split our t uh, split our shots here. Get some fire on both of them. It's not amazing shots, but it's okay. It doesn't have to be. Uh, no, I can, that's right, I can't precision shot. I have to do both if we're going to do that. Uh, and you're doing fine, although you might take a lot of return fire here. Who are you? You are the one who, was sh who shot that other building, aren't you? I 
need to get somebody out there to look at you. All right, let's just fire. If you say so. Oh, nice. And thud, 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 thud on you. Yeah, Commander. All right now, Commander. <laughs> oh, now, there you are. <laughs> I, I love the accent. Honestly, guys, I'm not making fun of the accent. I actually truly love it. <laughs> oh, now, that's just special. Goodness gracious. It reminds me of an old Midwestern, uh, Midwestern wife. She's just precious, you know. <laughs> I love it. I really do love it. Alright, let's see if we can't take out this Vindicator, or at least knock him on his butt. And a fire. Firing. Oh, be beautiful. Capsule eliminated. Good job, spare parts. Come on, fight me. Don't fight the building. Fight me. Mm, oh, my head. Hey. My armor's getting blown apart. What's, what's with the head hits, man? You don't need to be hitting me in the head. Trebuchet! And once again, I'm a building, right? Yeah, well, I mean... Oh, jeez. Stop hitting my buildings! I need to put some... Uh, and another one. Ooh, okay. I'm just gonna get another of my buildings. Don't take it out! Oh my god, how are you supposed to protect these things? Commander? I, I, I mean, honestly, how are you supposed to do it? Yes, Commander. Alright. Oh, jeez. Scoundrel, we're gonna have to, and spare parts, actually, both of you, we need to... Good to go. Hmm. <laughs> Tough call. All right, if we move you over here, I could put some fire on this guy. Do a precision to increase the, the odds, and more importantly, make him start, uh, uh, start looking at us rather than the buildings. Because everything from here is just us. All four of our mechs are, are going, so... You know what? In that case, I'm going to reserve. Reserve in action. Who is shooting at... Something is firing from the side. There's something firing from over here. Here comes another mech. What is shooting over here? Yes, All right, commander. rebound. You are in a terrible place. Jeez. Um, let's get you over here. Moving out. Ah, uh, wow. Uh, again, we're, we need to increase our chances of hitting here. We need to, we need to remove some fools here. If they both hit, it won't kill him, but it'll sure mess up his world. I was going to say, what about a headshot? <laughs> I could take out a torso, ooh, and that would, that would definitely make him, make his life miserable. Let's try for a torso shot. Come on, come on, take it out! You didn't take it out. Wow, seriously? 
an enemy had a turn, that means there's an assault on the field. Commander. All right, Catapult, you need to get out here and just and find out who the heck is shooting over here. Let's just turn it this way a bit so that just in case somebody over here decides he's uh, they're going to moving to position cause a ruckus. What is out here? Am I just missing it? Am I not seeing this? That is really frustrating. All right, let's sensor lock something. Uh, there's no point to it. Man, I wish you could back out and see the entire battlefield. I hate the fact that you can't. See, that's the edge of the map, so... But it's definitely coming from that direction. What the heck is going on? I don't know what's going on there. If there's something off the map shooting me, then honestly guys, I'm calling shenanigans with this uh, with this attack. Because that's that is that's ridiculous. Yes, Commander. All right, so we need to get you closer in so that we can see everything. We can spot all four of you guys. You are definitely going to be vigilanced because you're about to take a lot of hits. So what have we got here? We've got a Jager Mech, a second Jager Mech. Wolverine, a trebuchet, and of course this bad boy. Alright. Uh, no. Um, actually no, back out of that. Let's, let's do what we did last time. Let's do this, and you, and you, and we'll go boom, boom, boom. Our heat is just fine. Wreck face. Coffee. Come on, get a kill. No kills, but it's not awful. Waiting for orders. All right, Miss Waiting for orders. Uh. Wow. Why do we have such? A awful shots with you. Um, if we go here, I'll, ha I'll be closer. I'll have cover of the building. Uh, ooh, but they'll have some direct shots at us. I kind of like this. Get you closer into the action. I'm tempted to just take out the trebuchet, but I want to... I want to put some fire on some of the other stuff just so I can... Let's, let's take out the trebuchet. Let's see how you like this! Hassle removed. Part of his I'm job. Okay, for now. Part of his job is to take it. I mean, it's most. <sighs> See, look at where is it? Something behind us. Where? There's nothing there.
I'm getting screwed over by this game. I really do think that, because that's silly. Alright. Something from this direction. Oh, I guess, well, there is a lot of space out here. Ugh. Oh. Alright, I can't... Shoot. Yes, Commander. Alright, it's gonna have to be you. And I need to get you out here as fast as possible. Copy that. Let's say something popped up. There you are. There's a couple of things out there, apparently. Uh, right here. I have enough on my plate. I do not need to be sandwiched like this. Oh, this sucks. All right. Well, you're a stand and deliver kind of, kind of mech, so. I think for now we're going to reserve. Wait? Sure, why not? There goes another one. This is insane. This is insane! How are you supposed to do this? I mean, you have no opportunity to take care of this. I'm here. Alright. Ten four. Rebound, I need you to work some miracles here. Um... Yeah, I know, we're gonna overheat. Um... But if you're going to overheat, I will at least want you to overheat for a good reason. Uh, now it's going to have to be one of the TPCs, which means we're going to have to get rid of that one. gonna have to be this one and I'm gonna just have to get lucky here go <coughs> all right it's causing some some headaches all right yes come on this I'm kind of tempted to just come over here and and punch this thing in the face But I don't think that would be a good use of my of my resources here. Um, I think I'm going to go over here, jump jet backwards. A firm. Again, multi-target. And do Yeah, I'm gonna do you and you and go one, two, three. I think that's our best our best bet here. I'm still fine on armor, crush it. Engaging multiple enemies. Come on, I need you to I need you to do some work here. I need you to do some work here. Nice! Oh nice! Ah, 
Commander? All right. Spare parts? I... No, I, I can't. I, I don't have vision on them, and I can't spare her to have vision, so I'm just going to need to... To, to, to cause some, some damage here. Uh, I could potentially take you out. I need to I need to remove targets. Locking in all weapons. Come on, remove it, remove it. Thank you. Come on, people. Let's make it happen. Target eliminated. Target eliminated. She's a good one, you know, you know. Gonna come up behind me and punch me? No, you're just gonna shoot me. It's all right. The Highlander can take it. Oh. Internal structure disintegrating. Or maybe not. I thought I built you to be tougher than that. Maybe. Oh my god. This is insane. How are you supposed to deal with this? How are you supposed to deal with this? That was a Jager mech? Why is a Jager mech firing that many LRMs? They shouldn't even have that many J uh, uh, LRMs. Alright. Let's get you over here. Moving out. And I don't give a damn about he. You need to wreck this thing. Scored a critical hit. And there's another one over here. This is ridiculous. How are you supposed to keep these buildings alive? I mean, I would be okay if it were just me versus this many mechs. It would be a hard fight, but okay, I can ready for orders. I can I can justify that. But this is nuts. Alright, um Honey, I need to move you I, I need to turn you around because we need to put some fire on these. I I just I can't. I cannot justify. Um uh, uh, there's no way for me to have that work both ways, so we're just going to come over. Oh, he's going to have a shot at her back, which I am not thrilled about. I am not thrilled about it all, but... On my way! She hasn't been hit in the back yet, of course... Orion wasn't intended to get hit in the back, but I wasn't expecting this either. Confirmed. All right, give me a solid and take this thing out. Critical hit, Commander. Please knock you on your butt. That was ridiculous. That was utterly ridiculous. I'm no, guys, I'm sorry, but no, bogus. Absolutely ridiculous. Failed good faith effort. Okay, but good faith effort, but still, that was ridiculous. That was stupid. How was in any way, shape, or form was that possible? That wasn't even remotely possible. That that couldn't have even been attempted. Hmm. 
No, I, I am sorry, but, but no. <laughs> I mean, obviously we're gonna, we're gonna go forward with this. Uh, but uh, shenanigans, straight up, without a doubt, shenanigans. That was impossible to beat. It was impossible to beat. I saw that morale thing, and I saw the leg mod. Oh, oh, wow. Oh, boy. Ooh, I like that. I don't like the two tons, but I do like that. Plus two accuracy on missiles. That's very handy, but so is this. And that's no tonnage. You know what? We're taking this. That morale gain is very nice. And I got bits and pieces of anything. Sorry, guys. Shenanigans. I, I'm calling shenanigans on that whole thing. Uh, that wasn't possible. That was literally impossible. Coming from three separate directions... And they didn't target us. They targeted the, the buildings. We, wow. We lost big time money on that. <clears throat> oh, oh, I'm sorry. Oh, this is a financial report. Never mind. <laughs> uh, well, but actually, we did. We did lose an, a, a huge amount of, of money on that. Um, holy cow shenanigans. I, that's going to that's gonna make me angry for a while. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm heated. I'm heated. I don't like that at all. Absolutely 100% shenanigans. Absolutely 100% shenanigans. <clears throat> all right, so let's go ahead and get uh, work started on this. Uh, the, the next thing that we're going to be doing from here is we're going to be heading over to to the war council um it looks like huh what is... breakthrough on the brink <gasps> wow oh it's another defend the base no screw that i'm i am done with defend the base this is now and now i didn't you guys didn't see the the other um the other two times i've i've attempted defend the base all three times defend the base has been absolutely ridiculous absolutely ridiculous um which i guess explains why the rewards are always so hard because they're impossible they are impossible y you you get attacked from multiple different directions which is fine i mean i'm f if it were a, a, a stand-up battle i can handle uh, being able to get attacked from three different directions <clears throat> what i can't handle is the fact that they don't target your mechs they just shoot the, they, 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 they come with an enormous number of long-range weapons and they just blow up your 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 guy. And, and it doesn't matter what kind of... And, and I believe me, I've tried this with multiple different mechs. I've tried this with light mechs. Light, uh, light mechs don't have enough punch. I've tried it with medium mechs. Medium mechs don't have enough punch. They, they're too flimsy. They can't handle the... Uh, the, I, the best you can do is heavy and an assault and if you go in with heavy uh even the heavy it's like okay you've got enough uh, you've got enough firepower you've got enough armor to survive the encounter but then you don't have enough speed because you have to be able to get in fast enough to be able to get them to target your mech and not the uh, the, the 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 buildings themselves and like i said they come from two to three that this is the uh, i've only had one time where i came from two different directions not three um it's almost always three directions um and no every single time they crush your buildings before you have a chance to do anything uh and it's absolute it's impossible the this this game needs balance on defend the base uh absolutely needs balancing on that i have not i have not complete uh, actually beaten a defend base once not once. Uh, and I've tried re... Because I, I, the, <laughs> the first time I got my butt kicked... <laughs> uh, the first time I got beaten, I immediately just, like, I hit the save button. Or, I mean, I hit the load button, and I redid it. It was ridiculous. Tried it again, got beaten again. Tried it a third time, got beaten a third time. I quit. 
I said, never mind, I'm not going to do that. Obviously, that's just too hard for me. So I tried later on in the game. I tried it a second time. I tried a second defend the base, thinking, okay, that one was just a hard one. I, I, I'll just, I'll deal with it. No. <laughs> I got my butt handed to me that time, too. And again, it's always been good faith effort because I'm killing the crap out of their mechs, but there's no way to save the buildings. It's impossible. You can't do it. Uh, not from not having to, uh, to defend from three different directions. It's impossible. You cannot. You have to spread your four mechs out. In three different directions, you have to guess that the direction you're going is correct until all of a sudden, like you saw, they just sort of sneak up on you from behind. No, it's... I... No. No, no, no. That was a bogus, ridiculous... And now for the third time, you just saw what happened. I got my butt handed to me again, and what chance at all did I have? None! They destroyed my, my buildings before I had any chance! to be able to do something about it. No. Uh, shenanigans on defend the base. It needs balance. And that's all I'm going to say about that. I'm going to stop ranting about that. Uh, so I'm never doing another defend base again. Uh, the hell with that. Um, but I think before we go, let me go ahead and travel to Weldry because I need time to be able to get uh, my mechs fixed and, and upgraded anyway. So let's go to Weldry. Calculating course now. <clears throat> and let's check out the War Council, and then um, once I know what's what what's the next progress from there, um, I'll probably end the episode, and we'll we'll well we'll, we'll see what what comes in the uh, in the next episode. Let me get a drink of water from my water here. Yay. <laughs> yes, I'm geeking out over the grasshopper. Oh, okay. Samaria catches your attention on bridge. Commander, I picked up a distress call from nearby civilian transport. I think I've had this one before. Um, it's not exactly our job to assist in matters like this, but we may be the nearest ship available. On the other hand, it looks like the ship's engines are in a critical state. They could explode before we get there. Stay out of it. Most likely nothing will happen. It'll blow up. Investigate carefully. It probably, I'd say, it could get, explode before we get there. The, we, the chances of us being able to... Or we can mount an immediate rescue. Take the chance of getting hurt. But possibly rescuing them. Let's take a shot. Ah, dang it! When the Argo arrives at the source, of, uh, you feel a momentary surge of hope. They're spinning helplessly away, awaiting rescue. And then kaboom! Envelops to transport the survivors and the Argo. Ten thousand in damage. Or bruise morale. Let's just add insult to injury. <laughs> Ugh, sorry for sniffing in your ears, guys. Ugh. Oh, well. <coughs> Alright, so we've got a couple of days until we get to Weldry. Wow, several days before we get to Weldry. So, Relentless is back up. And... No nice. upgrades you asked for? Are online, Commander. All right, so this is actually kind of exciting because the Gamma Pod was kind of the the last thing to prevent us from getting um, the training modules here, which is kind of exciting um, because this allows all of my Mech Warriors with less than thirty thousand total experience. That's a lot of experience to get fifty per day. I might be able to get my B team. I mean, because I'm pretty sure my B team doesn't have a total of 30,000 experience. So for sure, they'll be able to gain from this. 
and anybody new that I come uh, that I bring in should start learning from this. So that's kind of exciting right there. Um, the repair and refit, obviously, mech tech is always important. Uh, the mech bays, very important. Although I don't have the money for that right now. Uh, all the different oh med bay. Oh, why would, does it have to be so exper uh, so expensive? <laughs> oh, but that's so important. And this one... Oh, wow! Chance of death from incapacitating damage, 5% less likely. And chance of death from lethal damage is 5% less likely. Oh, wow, guys, that's big. Plus, the two of them together would increase our medical to 12 instead of... I think that's... Yeah, to 12, the two of them together. Ooh, that's big. Of course, I need to have Med Bay 3 first. Um, wow, that's really big. <laughs> Low G pool plus two morale. When you have a large space with nothing critical in it, where the gravity is too low for livering quarters, the obvious choice is to fill it with chlorinated water. <laughs> Commander, come on! Low gravity swimming pool. I don't know what there is to even discuss here. <laughs> Okay, that's funny. <laughs> uh, that's that was funny. <laughs> okay. <coughs> oh, med bay, but it's too expensive. We can't do it right now. But man, do we need that med bay? That's really important. Um, so too expensive, but vital. Um, morale. We're okay for morale. I really do think it's got to be either this, which we don't have the money for, or this, which we do have the money for. So I believe. Roger that, Commander. Choice I'll made. Get the crew moving. Uh, that that's kind of just uh, you know, choice made. All right, two more days to Weldry, and then we can find out. We're nearly broke, Commander. You don't say. Let's find out what's going on here on Weldry. We've arrived. Uh, not yet. Take a look at our contract hall. Oh, showboat! Oh, showboat's not bad. Waiting on you, Commander. Oh, and I like her voice. She's like Glitch. Uh, let's see. Showboat. Amanda on. Born on a little planet nobody ever heard of. Always knew she was going to be a star. No way. She started out by participating in local talent shows where she repeatedly won Miss Congeniality, but didn't quite catch on with the local population of farmers and biologists. But after watching the mech dance, rut the mech dance routine, teenage Amanda put together a supportive great aunt scraped together the funds to take a mech dance routine. <laughs> <coughs> Scrape together the funds to take herself and her young charge off to Solaris 7. There, Amanda trialed at several gladiatorial stables before her savvy Green Ant provoked a small bidding war between the stables to get Amanda one of the mo most excellent rookie contracts in recent history. It was an uncommon move, but Amanda on was an uncommon find even in gladiatorial circles and she went over big from the beginning an absolute natural in the cockpit she was a popular sensation due to her skills style optimism and scrappiness guys i think we have to hire her on general principles <laughs> new mech warriors available i love it showboat wow showboat i let's let's just take a look at her just in case she's got some um Waiting for orders. I love it. I love it. Okay, so obviously we're going to need to get her some experience. Um, or maybe we'll just kind of sideline her for the time and let the let the, uh, the the training modules do their work. Um, no, store. That's what I wanted to do. <coughs> just to see what neat, nifty, special things we've got. And I don't care about urban mechs. 
Urban mechs are garbage. Large laser plus plus, but I don't like large lasers. Halfway decent, though. LRM 20. Ooh, another. Um, but not better than what I already have, so I think I'll hold what I have. PPC plus. Alright. I do have PPC stuff, but that's alright. Uh, so nothing particularly exciting. <laughs> nope. Nothing particularly exciting at all. Okay, guys, that's going to do it for this particular episode. In the next episode, we will launch the contract. We will find out what we need to get done. Um, <clears throat> and we will, and we're going to go ahead and uh, continue on with the main mission. Uh, but in, yeah, but, uh, yeah, I think that's going to do it for this particular episode. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like. It helps me out so very much. For those of you who are regular viewers of mine, please make sure you hit that subscribe button and share my videos on your social media. I truly appreciate it when you do. And for those of you who already support me in all the ways that you do, thank you guys so very much. You guys are definitely better than a, de than a defend base scenario. I'm just going to... Let it go, let it go. I'm not going to stress about that anymore. Let it go, let it go. I'm really angry and hardcore. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care about that screwed up mission. <sighs> and now I'm going to stop raging on. The mission didn't matter to me anyway. As always, everyone, always remember that anyone can be a mouse that roars, but it takes someone special to be a lion that squeaks. So embrace your inner lion and squeak on! Stupid defense. Grr!